Part 3. Hey guys, Zero here, and today we got part 3 of 4, the second inner case 2021 SBA. Before continuing, I highly suggest checking out parts 1 and 2, as I'm about to discuss what I expect for the final two parts here, so I'll give you a second to go click off this video and check out those parts, so... So for part one and part two, we opened four boxes, only got seven autos. So we're shorted auto. That being said, we got the current second best future watch auto. And we got like the number six or seven future watch auto there. So it's been really solid this far. I'm still anticipating a patch auto. Logic should say that these final four boxes aren't going to be very good, judging by these pulls here. But I mean, if we don't want to get shorted, I'm anticipating nine autos here. So one of those has to be decent, right? I mean, I wouldn't mind like a future watch inscribed. I pull like a couple of those a year. So there's that. All in all, I'm pretty content with the case there, but I'm still very intrigued to see what the patch out is going to be and what the remaining autos are so let's get right into it part three or four we got two boxes here boxes five and six okay box five of the inner box three had zero autos box four had three we definitely got shorted an autograph let's see if any of these parts makes up for it by giving us an extra auto in here but let's start off with the right stack here and get another byram here yeah byram celebrated moments okay and also another thing i gotta make sure i don't miss cards like this like the non-autograph numbered cards will be like a secondary insert in the pack like the future watch non-autos and the future icons i gotta keep that in mind but next pack up here we go oh we got a future watch right off the bat here on the right stack it's kind of weird but is it autograph yeah it's autographed okay let's see who this one is joel hofer Okay, that's actually pretty good. Joel Hofer, future watch auto. Quality goalie prospect for the Blues there. Looked pretty decent in his call up. I actually need to check the depth chart for the Blues for goaltending because I know Uso and Lindgren are gone. I forget who they signed, but there's Joel Hofer. That's pretty decent right there. I'll take that. I wish it wasn't the hockey DB picture. Wish it was an action shot, but there's Hofer. Decent goalie future watch, so I'll take that. Next pack up here for box number five. Anticipating a patch pretty soon here. Probably gonna be autographed right here, right? What do we got here? Well, there's some bait and uh, four card pack. Really, four card pack. Okay. I'm actually scared to open this stuff by the loose box, not just pack by pack. Like, a single box is pretty darn risky considering you could get absolutely nothing in a loose box. But it looks like we got a limited auto here, judging by that gold rainbow right there behind the limited red there. But there's a McDavid base, Sagan, limited red, and let's remove these back base cards. And let's slow reveal this limited autograph. Who is it of? 17. Uh, Dylan Strom. New Washington Capital. Dylan Strom. Limited auto. Auto's kind of faded there that's not too great but there's strong didn't get qualified by chicago questionably he was definitely one of the better players for chicago last year had a pretty strong finish there but there's dylan strom ace limited auto second auto of this box okay second last pack of the right stack here got a retro austin matthews last pack of the right stack here looks like the right side had all the autographs including a third one here we got a 2000 2001 retro sign of times i love the 01 sign of times design so finally getting one here right that's it yeah sign of times hopefully it's a good name heads here Brendan Gallagher? Okay, all right. Brendan Gallagher. 001 Retro Sign the Times Auto. Nice big bold autograph there for Gallagher. That's quality. I'll take that for sure. There's Gallagher. Third auto. There we go. That makes up for the last part. But let's continue on here. Already three autos in that first deck. Oh my gosh. We got a black card in here. Okay, could just be a base black, right? But it could be a black autograph. We shall see who it is. Let me take off these back base cards. Is it signed? Uh, maybe, maybe not. Vegas, Alex tuck yeah alex tuck is that signed yeah alex tuck dang base black limited auto with gold ink dang still haven't pulled a future watch black but there is a limited black auto with the gold ink there i mean it's on buffalo now but that's like the perfect team to have a black gold ink auto so really nice looking card there i'll definitely take it tuck was very solid for the sabers him and tage thompson so yeah really nice one there four auto box already dang okay let's continue on here i'm guess we're gonna get shorted in the next box or something because what is this oh we got another card here sb authentic hockey is this signed also like what is this is it autograph wait what oh it's a retro and it's a ranger wait what the heck is what keandre miller retro future watch auto the 10 11 retro there okay it's my third miller autograph from spa okay i mean really quality player to get multiples of but wow five auto box we are just hitting nothing but autos right now okay next pack up here is there gonna be even more autographs i wouldn't be surprised if there was or we just get shorted okay in terms of base cards that's the second four card pack we should be getting 
five in a pack, but we got another autograph. Are you kidding me? Olufsen, Kane, what is this? Okay, next limited auto is a blue. Colton Pareko, Damn, what is this box? Colton Pareko, limited auto. I'm pretty sure I already pulled that card. This auto looks a little bit nicer, so. Okay, what the, what? All right, two more packs here. See if the autos continue. I would not be surprised if they do. Oh, we got a retro, Keith Yandel, okay. And a final pack in the middle stack. I've lost count of how many autos we pulled. It's at least five, and we got moments here. Capri's off, okay. All right, final stack, final six packs. We've gone 50% for auto pulls. We have six autos in this box. Absolutely ridiculous. Is it gonna continue here? What am I looking at here? No, it's just a moments card. What is this? Oh, Quinn Hughes, moments, okay. Next pack up here. Is there something in here? No, retro, Eric Stahl. Okay, we got a thick pack here, and we get McDavid, true leaders. This stack has nothing in it. Okay, well, we got a limited red, Monahan, and we oh we got a retro to 100 i'm pretty sure that's a retro to 100 yes definitely to 100 three to one bam hey elias look at that there's my car there but elias the retro to 100 there that is 87 of 100 very nice there i'll take that there's an elias okay and the final pack for box five six auto box absolutely ridiculous i wouldn't be surprised if there's seven right here no we finally got our first spectrum there you go quinn Hughes spectrum oh my gosh what a box all right let's open box six and get zero autos that might be one of the craziest boxes of SBA I've ever opened. What the heck? Six auto box. Well, let's start on the left stack here because last time the left stack had nothing. I'm anticipating not a whole lot in this left stack here. It might be wrong though. We got a true leader. John Klingberg. Newest duck. John Klingberg, but they got him over Ben. K. It's interesting. Base. K. Second pack of the left stack here. Another retro. Matthew Kachuk. Another thick pack here. I'm still anticipating that patch auto here. We got a top performers. Elias. K. And then we got limited red jvr and then we get retro giordano final pack of the left stack i would not be surprised if there's zero autos in here six auto boxes are very rare but we got leaders rhino riley and let's move on to the middle stack see if there's anything in the middle stack here another leader stamkos k okay. next up here we got another retro marner pack three of the middle stack halfway point of the box still no autographs we got a moments to fully three more packs in the middle stack here another limited red and Aaron still no autograph second last pack of the middle stack still no autos another retro John Carlson and the final pack of the middle stack zero autographs in this box this far we got leaders Petrangelo now let's get on to that final right stack got two thick packs in there maybe one of these will be the patch auto still anticipating the patch auto it's probably not gonna be here just judging by feeling it there it's not so let's see what it is oh it's a moment there John Klingberg okay still waiting on that autograph here is there one here oh there is one here okay Okay. We shall see who it is. Let me remove some packs here. Make sure it's autographed. It's autographed. Okay, who is it of? Oh, ooh, was that Ryan McLeod? Yeah, that's quality. Dang, okay. Ryan McLeod, Future Watch Auto. He's darn good. Great skater. Current third line center for them. I would say pretty darn good upside for Ryan McLeod there. Very useful player there. Yeah, quality pull right there. Ryan McLeod, Future Watch Auto is our first auto of this box. All right, next pack up here. It's a thick pack, so maybe there's a patch in here. Uh, no, okay. We shall see what's in here. Do we have another autograph in here? Oh, we got a retro sign of the times, and it's Colorado colors, so we shall see who that is. So who could that be? Could it be like Bayern? I mean, McKinnon, McCarr, Landis guy. Be a lot of good names here. We shall see who it is. Okay, it's Bowen Byram. That's really darn good. Okay, <laughs> Bowen Byram. 001 Retro Sign of the Time. Dang. Still need his future watch auto. I kind of feel like it's going for a bit much. I know he has a lead upside, but he's never going to be ahead of McCarr. Let's be real here. But still a great young defenseman there. So as long as his injury problems are behind him, he'll be a great defenseman. So there is a Bowen Byram Retro Sign of the Times. Awesome. Okay, we got three packs left there. There's two autos are we gonna get another auto in here no nope. Parise limited red and the final two packs don't expect much in here retro seth jones and the final pack here we got the spectrum there you go alexiev spectrum yeah guys there's part three of the inner fantastic part here this is the first box alone got the elias to 100 there the preco limited auto the miller retro future watch auto got the tuck black limited auto there got the gallagher retro sign of the times got the strom limited auto and the hover future watch auto that's all from one box oh my god Gosh. And then the second part's a little bit calmer. Still really quality autos there though. The Byron Retro Santa Times and McLeod Future Watch Auto. I mean, wow. SBA has been treating me incredibly well this year. I don't believe it. This isn't the way it should be. So guys, stay tuned for the finale. And as always, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys later.